Are you getting low FPS, stutters, or lag even? You have a decent GPU. In this video, I'll show you how to fix low GPU usage step-by-step step so your graphics card works at 100% and gives you max FPS in every game. Let's fix that lag for good. Step 1. Fix low GPU usage by optimizing game mode and graphics settings. First, we will change some settings to make game mode work better. Click the Windows search bar and type Game Mode to open it in your settings. Turn Game Mode on. This setting helps your game run better by turning off extra background stuff and giving more power to your game. Next, go to Graphics Settings in Windows. Click on Browse, then go to the folder where you installed Fortnite. Find the Fortnite game file and add it to the list. After that, click on Fortnite from the list and press Options. Change the setting to Performance and then press Save. This step makes sure your graphics card, GPU, gives Fortnite the best performance possible. Gear Up Booster is a best tool to reduce your ping while playing games. It works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it for free from my description and enjoy smoother gameplay with lower ping. Step 2. Fix low GPU usage with GPU Priority Registry Tweaks for maximum performance. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Now we will use GPU registry tweaks to make Fortnite use your GPU better. First, open the folder called GPU registry tweaks. Inside this folder, you will find two registry files. Choose the one that matches your PC. If your PC is low end, use the file named low med optimization. If your PC is high end, use the file named med high optimization. These registry tweaks change how your GPU and Fortnite talk to each other. Picking the right one will help your GPU work more efficiently and make your game run smoother based on how powerful your computer is. Step 3. Fix low GPU usage by boosting CPU performance and unlocking all processors. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Now we will boost your CPU power using a program called Park Control. First, download and install Park Control. After installing it, open the app. Scroll down and pick a performance mode. Choose Bitsum Highest Performance to make sure your CPU runs at full strength. Next, check and change some settings. Set Parking AC to 100% and disable it. Set Parking DC to 100% and disable it. Set Frequency Scaling AC to 100% and disable it. Set Frequency Scaling DC to 100% and disable it. Now look for a setting called Bitsum Dynamic Boost and make sure it is enabled. This setting turns off unused CPU threads when doing light tasks like browsing but turns all of them back on when gaming for max power. Finally, open your Windows Power Options and choose Bitsum Highest Performance as your active power plan. Double check that all settings are set to 100%. Click. Make active, then press Apply to save. This helps your CPU and GPU both work at their highest level during gaming. Step 4. Fix low GPU usage by using MSI Utility to optimize hardware performance. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. In this step, we will improve your hardware's performance using a tool called MSI Utility. First, download MSI Utility from my official website. Link in description. Open it after downloading. Inside the app, look at the list and find your main GPU, graphics card. Tick the MSI box next to your GPU and set interrupt priority to high. Next, find your integrated GPU, like Intel. Check the MSI box for it too, and also set its priority to high. After making these changes, click apply and close MSI utility. This step helps your graphics hardware work better and reduce lag while gaming. Step 5. Fix low GPU usage by optimizing system memory. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Using ISLC program, now we will use the ISLC, Intelligent Standby List Cleaner program to improve your system memory for better performance. First, open the ISLC program. At the top, check how much total memory your system has. Set the list size to half of your total memory, for example. If it says 32,000 MB, type 16,000. If it says 16,000 MB, type 8,000. Now check these boxes. Start ISLC minimized launch, ISLC on user logon. On the right side, tick the box for enable timer resolution and set the value to 0 0.50. Leave the ISLC polling rate at 1000 unless your system is very slow. If it is, change the polling rate to 1000. Once all the settings are ready, click stop, then click start, and finally press purge standby list. This will help your system use memory better and support your GPU performance. In this step, I'm going to show you the best tool to get stable ping while gaming. So first, download the Gear Up Booster tool from the official website using the link in the description. 
after downloading install it on your pc once installed you'll see the gear up booster interface the first thing you'll need to do is log in with your facebook or google account on the home tab you'll find all the games installed on your pc if you go to the games tab you can browse thousands of games available for optimization to optimize your network and fps return to the home tab and select the game you want to boost for example i'll select fortnite click the boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game it will automatically find the best server for you next you'll need to choose your server region select the nearest server for the best connection in my case the middle east server works best after selecting the server close the window now go to the end tab where you'll see a list of servers available in the middle east choose the nearest one or let gear up automatically pick the best server for you i recommend setting it to automatic for the best results Finally close the window and launch your game using Gear Up Booster. This will help you optimize Fortnite or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Step 6. Fix low GPU usage by boosting GPU performance using MSI Afterburner. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Now go back to the main folder and install MSI Afterburner. Once it's installed, open it to see the main interface and settings. First, increase the power limit and temperature limit to the maximum by using the sliders. Do not change the core voltage. Next, go to memory clock and increase the value in small steps of 20. For example, if it starts at 0, try changing it to 20 or 40. After each change, test your game to make sure it still runs well. Keep increasing slowly until you get the best performance without problems. Once you are happy with the settings, click Apply in MSI Afterburner to save them. This helps push your GPU to give more power during gaming. Step 7. Setting up a performance monitor to improve CPU performance. Lastly, to make your CPU and GPU work better. While gaming, we will set up a tool that tracks its performance in real time. Start by clicking the Windows search bar, type performance, and select performance monitor from the results. When the monitor opens, look at the left sidebar, find data collector sets, and double-click to expand it. Next, click on User Defined, then right-click inside this section and choose New, followed by Data Collector Set. A window will pop up asking for a name. Type GPU Boost in the field. After that, select Create Manually and click Next. On the next screen, you will see different options. Check the box for Performance Counter, then click Next. Now it's time to add a Performance Counter. Click Add, and a new window will appear with multiple categories. Select Processor from the list. Below that, you will see Available Instances. Choose the highest number listed for your system. For example, if the highest number is 7, select it. After selecting, click Next, then Finish to complete this step. At this point, you should see GPU Boost in the list, but it will be stopped. To activate it, right-click on GPU Boost and select Start. Once it starts running, you can close the window, and the performance monitor will continue working in the background, helping your CPU perform better while gaming. If this guide helped you, make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more videos about gaming performance and Fortnite optimization. I'll see you in the next one.